In this video, we'll be reviewing the new co-creator tool in Zoho Creator. Co-creator is a Zia-supported, exclusively Zoho AI tool that helps its users build custom applications with only the use of user-entered GPT prompts. Before we jump in, if you find this video useful, please be sure to like and subscribe below. Feel free to leave any comments with questions or video requests. And as always, if you need any help with your Zoho instance, head over to our website, click on book a meeting, and we'll be able to hop in to help your team directly. Zoho Creator is known for its low-code innovation, but this new feature brings AI into the game in a big way. You don't need to touch a single line of code. AI handles everything from data models to forms to even some workflows. This feature is baked right into Zoho Creator. There are no extensions or add-ons or additional purchases required in order to access this. From your Zoho Creator dashboard, you'll now see an option that says create using Zia. The way that you would use CoCreator is by clicking on create an application, create with Zia, select the learning language model that you would like to use, whether you'd prefer to use Zoho's learning language model or OpenAI. You'll enter in your prompt and then let CoCreator do its thing and generate that custom application for you. A pro tip that you'll want to keep in mind, which is also applicable to using any AI tool, is to use as detailed of a prompt as possible. So mention who will use the app, what data they'll need, and what should happen at what points in time. And so as much as you are able to detail out the trigger points, any sort of workflow rule automation, specific data points that you need, as well as the use cases that the application will be used for, all of that information will help it be as accurate as possible based on what you're looking for. The way that you can leverage CoCreator isn't just in the creation of the entire custom application that you're looking to have built out. You can also use it to help you build out specific components within an existing Zoho Creator app. And so in this example that you can see on the screen in the Zoho Creator article, you'll notice that they are selecting a specific form component that they would like added into their Zoho Creator application. And from there, they're able to select the Create with Zia option. And then that similar functionality is in place where they enter in a prompt. And then from there, it'll assist them with building a general framework of what they're looking to accomplish. Another pretty neat use case for the use of CoCreator is that we do have that tool available on Zoho Creator's mobile app. Zoho Creator is known for having a pretty robust mobile UI already, and so it just kind of makes sense that as powerful of a tool as it is, they will be also including this AI functionality. Another cool feature about CoCreator is that it will also provide you with recommendations of integrations that you might want to include based on the data sources that you have in your Zoho Creator app. This feature here, Coding Smarter with Zia, is a, a component that a lot of us might already be familiar with, leveraging an AI platform to assist us with some code. Anyone who's already done that before might already be aware, you know, it's not always going to produce the perfect output for you. But with this being a Zoho learning language model, it can also help you with generating brand new code to implement into your system, or it can adjust the existing code that you have entered in. Um, so leveraging those prompts, maybe displaying, hey, this is the output that I'm getting from this workflow rule. It's not quite accurate. I wanted to do this. Um, the Zia assistant hypothetically should be able to provide you with some advice and guidance on that. I I would suspect that by leveraging a Zoho managed AI tool in order to assist with Zoho Deluge code might be a little bit more beneficial than leveraging ChatGPT or any other third party solution. Um, that is the assumption, of course, um, and so we'll, we'll have to see how it goes. Another space where the co-creator Zia tool can be used is in order to help transform any sort of data that you have inputted into your system. And so you can import data into the Zoho Creator app, and then by leveraging the co-creator Zia tool. It can help you cleanse the data, organize the data, and perform some data modeling for you as well. And so if you click on design here, we can see that a data schema model is produced. And so this is a, a very neat way for you to not only leverage the tool itself to build applications and optimize applications, but it's a really great way to become more familiar on the backend data flow because there aren't many applications within the Zoho ecosystem that can actually display a data schema in that type of modeled way. Zoho Analytics does have a similar data modeling feature, of course, where you can see all of the associations between the tables gathered from your analytics data sources. And so this data modeling through the co-creator tool is very, very similar. And so based on 
the uh, data that you're importing. It can analyze all of that, identify common variables, and then create that data schema and data model for you. For any sort of non-technical users, the co-creator tool would be great for founders, managers, or department heads who just want to get an app going without waiting on IT or software devs on their team to get started on it. Another use case could be internal prototyping. So let's say that developers are trying to pitch an idea for a new application to be built out for the team. Developers can now use CoCreator in order to rough out an app and refine it from there. The intention behind that would be that it would cut time essentially in half for any of those early builds. Agencies or consultants can also leverage this co-creator feature. Uh, they can use it as a client discovery tool, ask for their requirements, generate a base app, and then iterate all of the pieces of it together. I'm sure there are a few limitations or things to be cautious of as you move forward with leveraging the co-creator feature. You will still need to understand how Creator works in order to fully customize and maintain the app. While co-creator can build an application for you, build workflows and forms and data model, you'll always need to fact check everything that the AI tool is creating for you. Another thing that I would keep in mind is just to ensure that you aren't leveraging the tool primarily in order to create any sort of integration code. We'll want to make sure that any sort of integrations with your custom app will be performed a little bit more tediously, a little bit more carefully. Of course, the co-creator Zia tool will be able to get you in the right direction with things, but you'll always want to double check that all of the code looks accurate so that those integrations will flow without getting stuck. A really great way to think about the co-creator tool is personally how I like to think about any other AI tool that's out there, using it as a starting point and not necessarily as a full solution. And so using co-creator can help you get in the right direction with building your app out, building out forms, workflows, integration recommendations, code adjustments. But of course, you'll want to start there as a foundation and build on top of that just to make it uniquely yours and completely customized and accurate based on what you need. As always, anything that you will be creating using co-creator, be sure to review all of that information. And so review the output of the forms, the workflow rules, make sure you test the application to the fullest extent, just to make sure that the processes are processing as you would like them to. As of right now, this feature is included in the existing Zoho Creator plans. There is no extra pricing tier to have the AI tool added in. That said, we wouldn't necessarily be surprised if advanced AI features end up getting tiered later on down the road. And so it might be best to just explore the tool now while it's fully available to all of the Zoho Creator users. I hope you found this little update on Zoho Creator's co-creator tool helpful. Please be sure to like and subscribe below. If you have any questions about the feature itself, any comments or requests, feel free to comment down below. Thanks again.